Hey, it's Jim Fisher, a.k.a. The Beat, with This Week Community News, and I'm with Kyle Anderson from State Auto. Kyle, thanks for being with us today. Great to be here, Jim. Um, so we are at sort of an iconic Columbus uh, holiday tradition, right? This is the State Auto Holiday Display. Tell us a little bit about the history of why the company does this and for how long. Well, nearly 90 years now, Jim, and this is really a part of uh, who State Auto is and our founder. Uh, back in 1932, really uh, meant this as a Christmas gift to the Columbus community. It was uh, a very difficult time, as you know, uh, tail end of the Depression, okay. and he just wanted to, to give this to the community and, and make it a little more special for everyone. Right. Um, and so, uh, setup is uh, takes place for how long before you, you actually open do you start setting up the display? We start right around October 1st, okay. and that's pretty regular, and by uh, by about the, uh, you know, the week before Thanksgiving, we have it all in place and ready for the lighting, which is the first Wednesday of December. Okay, so first Wednesday of December for the lighting, and then throughout the season there is uh, entertainment and, and events that take place in and around here as well, yes? And we're excited this year because we have a record number of choirs performing. Oh, we're going to have exciting. every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday night throughout the month, 15 choirs in all from the 4th through the 23rd. Okay. Uh, typically we have uh, closer to 7 or 8, but uh, we're really excited about having that many this year. That is very exciting. And uh, uh, it's physical, right? So it, it gets updates and, and makeovers and stuff each year. Right yep. right behind us is something new for this year. Yeah, we, we typically make some tweaks uh, each year, and that was the place this year. The manger scene, we have a completely new backdrop, and we make some other tweaks that aren't so visible here and there. We had a group of our own employees who painted the nutcrackers that are on top of the building. They Way did that cool. this summer. Nice. So uh, it, it's really hands-on for us and, and something that we we take it personally. It's part of who we are okay. and we, we love sharing with the community. And for people who want details, find out more about uh, what's going on and how they can come see it and, and experience some of this stuff, where can they go? Uh, videos, photos, choir schedules at facebook.com slash Christmas Corner and at stateauto.com slash Christmas. Terrific. Well, Kyle, thanks for being with us today. Really appreciate it. And for more on holiday happenings, music, dance, theater, all around Central Ohio, check out your local edition of The Beat in This Week Community News and online at thisweeknews.com.